A missing persons case northwest of the metro has ended with the tragic discovery of a 17 year old girl. And now the Calhoun County Sheriff's Office says it's made an arrest. I'm Erin Kiernan and I'm Lindsay Burrell. The girl was reported missing just yesterday and today the body of body of the missing 17 year old was found. WHO 13's Roger Riley is live from Farnhamville and has the latest on this murder investigation. Roger. Yeah, Lindsay and Aaron, the bulk of the investigation was taking place here in the city park, which is the only park in town. Jerry Everhart lives just across the street from the park. I woke up and the streets and the park was clear full of police cars. I mean, high patrol, BCI, every, I mean, three or four counties around here, all there's local police, everything was just solid this morning. And I said, I had one sheriff's office come to my door. He wanted to know if I had any cameras. I didn't. Um, they said they were missing a girl, and that's all he would say. Now, uh, part of the investigation was also happening here uh, this afternoon. This is a look at the yellow tape had been taped on this intersection on the east edge of town had that road closed. Now, the city park, as I said, is the only one here in town, and it was pretty much back to normal uh, by midday. The town's fire station had turned into a law enforcement center with Calhoun County and the DCI and other area officers working on this investigation. Jerry Everhart told me that this small town usually is pretty quiet. Not much ever happens here. This is the first time I've ever happened for, I said, I've been here 57 years, and that's the first time I ever had anything like this happen. Wow. So you kind of, what did you think when you looked out the window, kind of well, shocked? Yeah, I didn't know what was going on. I seen all this stuff around, and then I seen them, the police just crawling all over the shelter house, had that all taped straight off, so I figured something, everything happened over there, but I didn't know what it was, so. Now, I did also speak with the Calhoun County Attorney Ben Smith, who told me uh, that there was nothing new that they could add. This the investigation is still ongoing. He did confirm, as you said, fatality and one in custody, and there is no danger to the public here in Farnhamville. All right, an investigation we will continue to report on. Roger, thank you.